Oh no, this is this is about to get real bad. This is about to get real bad. Hello interwebs and welcome back. I'm Shanna and this is why I share my life and stories and visions and opinions and whatever else I feel like. And today we are back with another creepy, spooky webtoon story brought to you by the series Chir Chiller Thriller over on Webtoons. The link to the story will be down in the description below so make sure to go check it out, show the author and the artist some love. And without too much rambling, let's go ahead and get into the story. Alright guys, so today we are on episode number 27, Peephole by Honeybee. We have our sound turned on, but not too loud, hopefully. And the following is a special chiller thriller which may include shocking scenes. Viewer discretion is advised for pregnant women, the elderly, and those with weak hearts. Okay, it was a, was a little too loud. Turn it down some. Oh, uh, the cicada. And a fan. Hi, Mom. Here? It's super hot. Air conditioning? I can't turn it on. Because of the electricity bill. I always keep the door locked. Oh, she's sweating. Yeah, I'll see you next month. Okay, bye. Click. Shiver. Ooh, why is she shivering if she's so hot? What was that? Glance. Whoosh. Oh, ooh, the phone vibrated. Oh, creepy, creepy guy looking at her. Jump, of course, me too. <laughs> ah! Da, 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 da. From the 2015 horror series, Chiller, People. Why has he got red eyes? Yoon Ho Lee. Yoon Ho, would you mind coming over to my place? What is it now? Somebody was looking into my room before. I'm too afraid to be alone. I'm at work. Report it to the police. I did, but the guy didn't actually break into my place. What if it's another stalker like before? Yunho, I'm really scared. All right, I'll go over on the weekend. Could you please? You're way too sensitive. Click. But the weekend's still so far away. He just doesn't care because it's not happening to him. Beep. I'm not sensitive. This is normal for a girl living by herself. I guess I'll have to handle my own safety. I feel so anxious even after locking the door and the windows. Living alone. Please only post things about living alone. Refrain from excessive criticism and swearing. Okay, so this is like a, a message board it looks like. Rules for living alone. Uh, tips to store food. Waste without it smelling bad. Sorry, it's hard to read. Having a cat and dog at the same time when your mom suddenly shows up, all these different ones. It looks like she's hovering over hot baseball plays born in the 90s. That doesn't sound like it has anything to do with living alone, whoever made this post. Oh, she's going to murder hiding in a girls only apartment building. Ooh, okay. I'm just gonna surf the web because I'm scared. Hey guys, did you see this article? There's this crazy guy hiding in this girl's apartment in XX Dong. She lives alone and he was hiding in there for like three days, but she didn't know. Some freaking scary shit. Apparently he was hiding under the bed. Thank God I don't have a bed. Yeah, they probably have futons there. Oh my God, I live in XX Dong, scary as hell. Ugh, me too. Do you think the property value will drop in XX Dong? Don't you find places like armoires and underneath bookshelves kind of freaky? The poster is kind of an idiot. Look at him laughing because he doesn't have a bed. Why are you so harsh? Go and get some a glass of cold water or something. When you're lonely and afraid, having a religion can really help, guys. Fear and terror are just temporary illusions when you accept a more spiritual higher truth. This seems like a real legitimate forum conversation, honestly. Apparently, he was hiding under the bed. Don't you find faces like places like armoires under the desk kind of freaky? Under the bed? No, no way. Someone could actually hide under a bed? Glance. Doesn't look like under your bed. You got drawers unless they don't go all the way back, girl. Flash. I think that's not really there. There's no way. Shiver. There's no way. Yunho, 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 I think someone's under my bed and it's freaking me out. What should I do? Should I get a knife? Lately there have been a lot more crimes against women living alone, you know. Why won't he answer? I'm too scared to go on like this. I have to do something about this myself. Rattle, rattle. 
If it looks like someone could be hiding under here, I'll just cover up all of the cracks. Wait, there could be someone hiding in the armoire, too. Thud. Dear God, that made me jump. I have to cover up every space and crack that I can. I can't leave a single crack uncovered. Wait. Under the sink! Turr, rattle. Durr. She seems paranoid, honestly. When are you coming? I'm too afraid to be myself. I'm probably safe now, right? I covered up every space in the house in case there's someone there. I should be okay now, right? Sorry, I've got cat hair on my lip. There's always cat hair on my lip. Thud. Beep, 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 beep. Who's that? Did my next door neighbor try the wrong door? Is it someone drunk? Who is it? Silence. Step, step. Yoon Ho Lee. I think there's someone outside my door. Someone was messing with the door keypad. What if they can see through the crack in the door? I think someone's in my apartment. Jeez, I seriously think there might be something wrong with you. Why won't he believe me? What if something happens to me? What then? Yeah, they could be watching me with a secret camera or through a narrow crack or, or, what about under my pillow? Oh, she's losing it. She's losing it for sure. That is really creepy though. That's it. I have to cover my, cover even the smallest cracks. Ugh. Is she taping stuff? Oh my God. Yeah, she's taping stuff. Oh my God. She's super parent. What happened to her before? I know she says she got stalked. I covered everything, even the sink. What about the toilet? I took the legs off the chairs. Should I cover the cracks in the desk too? There's not a single crack left. Not one. Uh, my phone's out of batteries. Sk. That's just you, sweetheart. She's so like paranoid. Squirm. Oh no, she sees eyes in her mouth. Stop it. Whoosh. What the? No, there can't be a single exposed crack. I have to block them. All of them. Oh, no, no, no. This is... Ugh. Ugh. I'll cover them all. Then I won't need to be afraid anymore. Cover them all so that no one can peek at me again. Gasp. It hurts. I can't breathe. At least now I can relax. There's scissors. Oh no. Huh? Why are you staring at me again? Why? Stop it, just stop it. Please just disappear. Go away, go away, stop staring at me. Just go away, screw off. Oh no, this is, this is about to get real bad. This is about to get real bad. That's enough. <gasps> Splat. Oh no, no, no. Knock, knock, knock. Knock, knock, knock. Huh? Did she change the password? Where did you go, sis? I came by because I was worried about her and now she's not even answering her phone. She can be so weird sometimes. Oh, this is sad. She forgot to cover some... Okay, we're gonna wait to read the comments. That one, it wasn't so much spooky or scary, but it was definitely pretty, I think, realistic in the sense that People do lose it in that way, and that's really sad to me. That was, this was definitely more like disturbing. I think disturbing is a good word for this one. Let me know if you guys agree. The art was pretty good in this one. I liked the sound effects, the music, not the music, just, you know, the background noises and stuff. And I think the story was pretty good. So I'm gonna go ahead and give this one four out of five ghosts. You can let me guys, let me know if you guys disagree or not in the comments. Sorry, I'm stumbling over my words so much today. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. And let's go ahead and read the comments now. She forgot to cover some other holes she has. Oh, inappropriate. <laughs> I think she just made more holes by stabbing herself. Facts. That's intense OCD. It is absolutely intense OCD. That was a intense story as far as you know mental disturbances might go but yeah let me know what you guys think down in the comments because that pretty much wraps it up for this one i hope you guys liked it if you did please make sure to like comment subscribe and if you don't know what to comment down below leave some scissors
a scissors emoji. Not only does it help with my channel a lot, but it lets me know that you were here. It gives us a chance to chat. It lets me know you made it to the end of the video. And of course, I just love to see your faces down there. If you want another way to help with my channel, down below there are links to my website, my merch store, and my Patreon. There's zero obligation to check any of those out. But if you want to, you can. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. I appreciate all of you so very much. Remember to stay ginky AF, and I will see you next time. Bye. Oh, hello there. Yes, uh, this is me casually drinking from my Ginky AF merch because uh, I don't have any bloopers to share. But if you like my cup or my shirt or some leggings or some socks, there's links in the description below. Be ginky as and enjoy your coffee or tea or water or whatever else you like to drink from mugs.